So this we've tried to address all that in building a small lightweight unit. We don't hit the tire as hard on the street. The more inertia is created with a flywheel, when you drop the clutch, you've got to stop that whole mess. Well, the larger and heavier I make that wheel, the harder it is to stop it. That translates right to the rear tires, mm -hmm. and the tires break loose and spin. So the lighter I can make the clutch assembly, the less the tires hit, so to speak, the less it wants to spin, so better traction. Uh, and far as horsepower, that's where the centered iron materials come into play. The higher coefficients of friction enables me to hold the six, seven, eight hundred horsepower engines. This is the same kind of unit we use in all the Bonneville cars. Um, guys making 1,000, 12, 1,500 horsepower. They're not banging gears like drag cars, so the load's not as great, but we still have the clamping ability because of the coefficients. And it's lightweight. You gain more mile per hour, the lighter you can make the clutch assembly. Mm -hmm. You're going to have higher mile per hour numbers. Interesting.